18 animals lost to extinction. Welcome to Throwback Thursdays. Number 18, the dodo. In 1598, Dutch sailors made the first recorded mention of this animal. The flightless bird was native to the island of Mauritius in the Indian Ocean. Although its exact appearance is still debated, illustrations and accounts from the 17th century vary quite a bit. The dodo is thought to have stood about one meter tall and weighed over 39 pounds. Sailors and invasive species hunted the bird to extinction. The last sighting of the dodo was in 1662. At least, that's the year most researchers agree upon. Number 17. Tasmanian Tiger. You know about the Tasmanian Devil, but what about the Tasmanian Tiger? In prehistoric days, it lived in Australia, Tasmania, and New Guinea, and it was a large carnivorous marsupial. It had no relation to tigers, by the way. The dark stripes on the backs just gave it a tiger-like appearance. It looked more like a medium to large-sized dog, weighing some 66 pounds and over six feet long from nose to tail. On the Australian mainland, the so-called tiger went extinct some 2,000 years ago, but it survived in Tasmania. The animal was likely hunted to extinction, but humans invading the habitat, along with the introduction of dogs and diseases, also played their parts in their demise. Number 16. Stella's sea cow. This was a big herbivorous animal that looked like a seal with a tail that resembled a whale's. They were discovered in 1741 by the naturalist George Stella and inhabited islands in the Bering Sea and islands southwest of Alaska. It's thought the animals weighed up to 10 tons and grew up to 29 feet long. Human hunters found the sea cow an easy target due to its slowness, its tame disposition, and the fact that it couldn't submerge its huge body. Stella's sea cow was hunted to extinction within 27 years of its discovery. Manatees and dugongs are their nearest living relatives. Number 15. Great Auk. Found in the North Atlantic, this animal was hunted for more than 100,000 years and was used for food and fish bait, which reduced the bird's population. The European population of the bird was nearly wiped out due to high demand for the bird's feathers in the 16th century. The Great Auk was a big, flightless bird, weighing about 11 pounds, with an average height of over 2 feet. In the British Isles, the last of the Great Auk were killed in Scotland in 1844. Number 14. Woolly Mammoth. It's believed this enormous animal appeared on the scene over 400,000 years ago, spread across northern Eurasia and North America. Known for their trademark fur and curved tusks, which could be as long as 5 meters, these creatures could weigh over 6 tons and reach up to 4 meters in height. They were built to survive the harsh environment of the last ice age, and we're not talking about the movie here, incidentally. Around 10,000 years ago, the big animals disappeared from their stomping grounds, rapidly melting ice played a huge factor in their extinction, as did humans hunting them down. Researchers think the last of the woolly mammoths disappeared around 700 BC. Number 13. Javan tiger. Native to the Indonesian island of Java, these cats resembled Sumatran tigers. They were once so numerous that locals considered them pests. Well, that was in the 1800s. By the 1950s, only 20 of these animals survived. Encroachment on its habitat and agricultural development diminished the Javan tiger's numbers. Number 12. Passenger pigeon. When Europeans first arrived in North America, up to five billion passenger pigeons were thought to inhabit the continent. All those settlers resulted in massive deforestation, which meant the birds lost their habitat and their numbers dwindled. Their extinction was also hastened by widespread hunting after pigeon meat was turned into a cheap source of food for slaves and the poor. In the wild, passenger pigeons died out around 1900, but in captivity, the sole survivor died in 1914. Number 11, West Black African Rhino. Weighing up to 2,900 pounds, poachers hunted the animal for its horns, which some cultures believe contain medicinal properties, although that has never been scientifically proven. The last West African Black Rhino was seen in 2006 in Cameroon. In 2011, it was declared officially extinct. Number 10, Zanzibar Leopard. 
This big cat was native to Unguja Island of Zanzibar in Tanzania and is grouped with the African leopard. Efforts to exterminate the animal in the 20th century escalated as locals believed the animals were evil predators kept by witches. There's still much about the Zanzibar leopard that's unknown, with only six skins located in museums. It's never been studied in the wild, and you'd have to go back to the early 1980s to find the last time a researcher made a printed claim to have spotted one. Still, despite government stats that show hunters still killing leopards and islanders reporting the occasional sighting, most zoologists think the animal is extinct or nearly so. Number 9. Round Island Burrowing Boa It was once found burrowing on Round Island off the coast of Mauritius. You may recall that the dodo also hailed from there too. This snake was also found on other islands in the region. As its population dwindled, it could only be found on Round Island after 1949. Non-native species of goats and rabbits destroyed vegetation after being introduced to the island, eradicating the boa's habitat. The snake was last seen in 1975. Number 8 saber-toothed cat. They existed between 55 million to nearly 12,000 years ago. Also known as the saber-toothed tiger or lion, they got the name from the blade-like upper canine teeth, which could measure up to 50 centimeters long, depending on the species. They were really big cats. The partial leg bone the size of a horse was found by a trawler in the North Sea in 2008. That picture comes from the article from the Telegraph UK. These carnivores could open their jaws nearly twice as wide as today's lion. They they were powerful enough to hunt prey as huge as mammoths that may have been part of the downfall. As larger prey was replaced by smaller animals, the saber-toothed cat may have been too specialized to adapt. That, along with competition from humans and climate change, may have played roles in their becoming extinct. Number 7. Quagga. This animal was native to South America. As you may have guessed, they were actually a subspecies of the common plain zebra. Hunters coveted the animal for its brownish, partly striped hide, which inspired some to call it a horse tiger. Hunting, along with competition from livestock for grazing land, led to the quagga's demise. The last of its kind died in the Amsterdam Zoo in 1883. Number 6. The Pauli, also known as a black-faced honey creeper. This animal, native to Maui, was discovered in the 1970s, but by 1997, only three known survivors remained. Efforts were made to mate the remaining birds, but those efforts failed. By 2004, the species was formally declared extinct. What happened? Well, disease, predators, and loss of habitat are blamed as reasons for the bird's extinction. Number five. Tacopa pupfish, a fish living in the desert? The Tacopa pupfish called the Mojave Desert its home, and it was known to survive in water temperatures up to 108 degrees Fahrenheit. But the animal's habitat was spoiled after development in the mid 20th century, and the pupfish was extinct by 1970. Number four. Madarin Large White Butterfly. This beautiful butterfly was native to the Laura Silva Forest Valleys on Portugal's Madeira Islands. Pollution from agricultural fertilizers and construction leading to loss of habitat are major reasons for the species' eradication. The Large White Butterfly, a close relative, is still commonly found across Africa, Asia, and Europe. Number three. Caribbean Sea Monk. These seals had been aggressively hunted for the meat, fur, and oil. It started with European explorers in the late 15th century, and the tradition was later continued by whalers and fishermen. The seal's traditional habitats in the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean Sea were ravaged by coastal development and fishing operations, which also hastened their demise. The Caribbean Monk seal was last seen in the early 1950s and declared extinct in 2008. Number two. Pyrrhonian ibex. The ibex, or ibex, was once found throughout the Spanish, French, and Andorran Pyrenees. The population was decimated by hunting, and the species went extinct in 2000. But in 2009, scientists used DNA from preserved skin samples and actually cloned a female ibex. Unfortunately, the clone died from lung defects shortly after birth. Number one. Bubal hartebeest, also known as the Bubal antelope, ancient Egyptians once used this animal for sacrificial purposes. It called North Africa its home and was a common sight there. But European hunters steadily wiped out these beasts for sport and food. 
The last Bubel Hartebeest was a female and died in 1923 at the Paris Zoo. You can see her picture here. See you next week on Throwback Thursdays.